Hi guys, Archie Luxury on the Archie Luxury channel. Today guys, I'm making a special video for Muhammad. Muhammad. And I got to tell you something guys, quick wristwatch check. I'm wearing my Sky Dweller. <coughs> guys, Muhammad sent me $100 US. And this was for the Indian food you took Timmy to. And I got to tell you, this is... Uh, this is this is processing job number 22QB6. 22QB6. Um, I got to tell you, one thing about going to England is <coughs> I think England has the best curry in the world. And I'm a huge curry fan. And one thing I got to tell you is, Muhammad, I think London has some of the best curry I've ever tasted. Now... The interesting thing is, I have been in pursuit of a good curry for many, many years. In fact, not so long ago, uh, in 2000 and, well, actually that was a number of years ago, 2013, 2013, I went to Fiji. Fiji has a big Fijian Indian population. And I was looking, I was really looking forward to tasting the curries. However, a lot of their curries are actually powder based. They're not proper, they're not wholesome, good. The curry, they use a lot of curry powder. And I got to tell you something, no disrespect to the Fijian Indians, but I don't think their curries were that great. And I got to tell you, the best curries, Australia has a mixed bag of curry. But London, man, the curries were amazing. I remember the first night, first day I landed in London, uh, Paul Thorpe actually took me and Timmy and Red Shovel to a curry restaurant. And I thought it was amazing. Paul just said, oh, it's pretty average. I thought it was pretty damn amazing i thought it was was sensational and the 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 interesting thing is uh we then i had different curries i had a few curries when i was in london so we had, the first night i had with paul thorpe a curry then we went over to bq watches spencer at bq and we had a banquet that was we had curry there that was sensational i didn't think that was any worse or better than the first night with Paul. Then, when I was leaving the UK, and obviously you know the disaster, the disaster. I'll put a link here. This is when I nearly got arrested at Heathrow Airport. Um, I was forced to stay an extra night. Timmy had helped me with the day. And I said, Timmy, I'm gonna shout your dinner. And that's what Muhammad had sent me the 100 US later on to reimburse me. And we went to a, it was a Sheraton. It was a Sheraton and they had a, because I said, Timmy, let's get something to eat. So we checked into, I checked into my hotel and Timmy said, oh, it is a McDonald's there. I said, Timmy, we're not going to McDonald's. I want to buy you a fucking nice meal. So what we did was we went to, we walked down the street, there was a Sheraton and it had an Indian restaurant inside there. And me and Timmy had the meal of our life. That was, sense. it was expensive. It was not cheap. Uh, it was incredible. They had these, oh <clears throat> man, the curries, the flavors were incredible. Absolutely incredible. And I reckon that was probably <clears throat> the best the best Indian I've ever had. Now, that wasn't the best meal on the trip. <laughs> the best meal on the trip was actually Alex had paid for me to take bondage and discipline to the Gordon Ramsay steak restaurant in London. I think that was mind blowing. Actually, and then the, a couple of nights later, bondage and discipline took us to this other Indian restaurant. It was a very so it was in Kensington. That was actually fucking amazing. I remember I ate Bondage and Discipline Sons leftovers. It was so amazing. 
but that one at the Sheraton, I think Bang Po Bai, look, the, the restaurant that Bondage and Discipline took us to, the Indian restaurant, was sensational. It was bloody expensive. So I'm sort of looking at Bang Per Buck. I think that restaurant at the Sheraton, <coughs> I thought that was absolutely amazing. I thought that was absolutely amazing. So uh, I just want to say, Muhammad, I love you. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I will catch you in the next one. Muhammad, thank you so, so much. Hi guys, it's Archie Luxury. Guys, I want to talk to you about David SW. David SW, David SW. Guys, if you are in America, if you are looking for a Rolex watch of your dreams, in fact, if you're looking for a contemporary modern wristwatch, I strongly advise you to look at David SW. Guys, don't play the dealer games. Don't bring in chocolates or crispy creams for your dealer, hoping to get a Rolex at retail. It's futile. Please, guys, save your dignity. Keep some pride. Go to David SW. I would highly recommend David SW, David SW. If you're in America and you're looking for a watch, go to David SW, David SW, David SW. Hi guys, Archie Luxury, and today guys, I'm very proud to introduce a new sponsor of the Archie Luxury and the Paul Pruder channels. Who am I talking about? Watchshopping.com, watchshopping.com, watchshopping.com. Check them out, guys. Jump online, check out watchshopping.com. These guys here have been in business since 2017. Worldwide shipping and distribution. Over 10,000 wristwatches in inventory. Stock in hand and 90 plus different brands, new and pre-owned. Now, the good thing about watchshopping.com, trusted by over 4,000 reviews on Chrono24 and Trustpilot. Your one-stop shop to buy any watch your heart desires. Please, guys, check out watchshopping.com, watchshopping.com, watchshopping.com. I'm Archie Luxury, and check out watchshopping.com. Hey guys, Archie Luxury on the YouTube sensation, the Paul Pluto channel. Guys, I need you to help me out, guys. I can't survive on Google Ads alone. I need you to request a paid review. 50 US dollars, look down in the description. 50 US dollars, re I will review your collection. I'll tell you what I think of it, and I'll give you some pointers. The other thing is, guys, you can sponsor me on Patreon. Patreon allows you to pay a couple bucks a month, a dollar, two dollars, five dollars, whatever you want. And it keeps me going on YouTube because, guys, I'm in a niche. Nobody can make money out of the views I get. The views are crap because it's a small, specialized area. And I don't talk about garbage for the sake of views. Guys, sponsor me on Patreon. Look down below and I will see you in the next one. Yeah.